If you're looking for inspiration on how to turn your passion into a successful business, look no further than Martha Stewart. She's the ultimate example of someone who has worked hard to turn her interests into a thriving enterprise. Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel, Business Up. In this exciting video, we will explore the journey of Martha Stewart, how she became a business entrepreneur, her brands, her jail time, and what she does now to make money. In the world of business, there are few names as recognizable as Martha Stewart. She has built an empire of brands and products that have made her one of the wealthiest and most influential women in America. But it wasn't always this way for Martha Stewart. She started from humble beginnings and worked tirelessly to achieve the success she enjoys today. So, without further delay, let's get straight into the video. Martha Stewart was born on August 3, 1941 in Jersey City, New Jersey. She was the second of six children and grew up in a middle-class family. From a young age, Martha had a passion for cooking and entertaining. She learned many of her skills from her mother, who was an excellent cook. After graduating from high school, Martha attended Barnard College in New York City, where she studied art history. After college, Martha began her career as a stockbroker on Wall Street. However, she quickly realized that this was not the career for her. Instead, she decided to pursue her passion for cooking and entertaining. She started a catering business and quickly gained a reputation for her exceptional food and attention to detail. How she became a business entrepreneur Martha Stewart became a business entrepreneur by leveraging her passion for cooking and entertaining. She started her career as a caterer, where she honed her skills in the kitchen and gained a reputation for her exceptional food and attention to detail. She then began writing books on cooking and entertaining, which proved to be a huge success. This led to the creation of her magazine, Martha Stewart Living, which helped to establish her as a lifestyle expert. Martha's success as a writer and TV personality allowed her to expand her brand into a wide range of products, from cookware and bedding to paint and gardening tools. She was able to use her name and reputation to sell these products in major retailers such as Macy's and Home Depot. Martha also launched several TV shows that focused on cooking, entertaining, and lifestyle. Martha's entrepreneurial spirit and determination were evident in everything she did. She was willing to take risks and try new things, which helped her to stay ahead of the curve in the competitive world of business. Did you all know this before? Stay connected because there is still a lot to watch. Building the Martha Stewart's brand Martha Stewart has built a wide range of successful brands over the course of her career. Her flagship brand is Martha Stewart Living, which includes a magazine, website, and television show. This brand focuses on cooking, entertaining, and home decor and has been hugely successful. Martha has also created several product lines, including Martha Stewart Collection, which includes bedding, cookware, and other home goods. She has partnered with major retailers such as Macy's and Home Depot to sell these products. In addition to her home goods brands, Martha has also expanded into the food and beverage industry. She partnered with Marley Spoon to create a line of frozen foods, and she has a line of CB skincare products called Martha Stewart CBD. Martha's ability to create successful brands in multiple industries is a testament to her entrepreneurial spirit and business savvy. How impressed are you by the above information? Let us know in the comment section and stay tuned. Now let's talk about her jail time. In 2004, Martha Stewart was convicted of obstruction of justice and making false statements to federal investigators in connection with a stock sale. She was sentenced to five months in prison, followed by five months of home confinement. Martha's time in prison was a challenging experience for her, but she emerged from it with a renewed sense of purpose. Despite the negative impact of her time in prison on her personal and professional life, Martha managed to bounce back and continue building her business empire. She maintained her commitment to quality and innovation, and her brand remained popular with consumers. Martha has since spoken publicly about her time in prison, and has used the experience to advocate for criminal justice reform. Her story serves as a reminder that even the most successful entrepreneurs face challenges, but with determination and resilience, they can overcome them and continue to thrive. Stay connected, maybe we are just jumping into an end. But Martha does now to make money. After her release from prison, Martha returned to her business empire. Martha Stewart continues to make money through her various business ventures, including her TV shows, product lines, and partnerships. She has several TV shows that are currently on the air, including Martha Knows Best on HGTV and Martha Bakes on the Food Network. These shows allow her to showcase her cooking and entertaining skills to a wide audience and keep her brand relevant in the ever-changing world of media. Martha also continues to expand her product lines with new partnerships and collaborations being announced regularly. She recently partnered with Canopy Growth to create a line of CBE products for pets and has a line of homewares with QVC. Martha is also involved in the world of fashion with her own line of shoes and a partnership with designer Zach Posen to create a line of kitchenware. 
In addition to her business ventures, Martha is also known for her connections to celebrity friends and associates. She has been spotted socializing with a wide range of famous faces, including Snoop Dogg, Oprah Winfrey, and Gwyneth Paltrow. She has also done business with other high-profile figures, such as Ryan Seacrest, who is an investor in her company, and Kevin Sharkey, who is the executive director of design for Martha Stewart Living Omni Media. Overall, Martha Stewart continues to be a force to be reckoned with in the world of business and media. Martha Stewart is a true business icon who has turned her passion for cooking and entertaining into a thriving enterprise. She has built a successful brand that includes books, TV shows, magazines, and a wide range of products. Although she faced a setback with her prison time, Martha has continued to grow her business empire and remains a highly respected figure in the world of business. Her story is an inspiration to anyone who has a dream and is willing to work hard to achieve it. This was all about today's video. See you soon in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, we would love to hear how much you enjoyed it. Feel free to leave a comment. Also, don't forget to check out the poll in the community section after the video. Be sure to subscribe to the channel so that you can see more awesome videos like this in future. Thank you.